Good Saturday morning, YouTubers, friends and neighbors. Oops, about to drop my camera. Uh, this is your old friend Jim at East Tennessee Preparedness. Was a busy boy yesterday and so far this morning. Time to time to quit being lazy. So I hope everybody had a good week. A uh, buddy of mine and myself went up to Rural King and I got some chicken feed. Looked around, they had a lot of baby chicks. If anybody's wanting to have them a backyard flock like I do, then they have had a bunch, a bunch of rabbits if you want to raise rabbits. And uh, they had freedom seeds. And I'm not, they had a 12 gauge, 308. 223-556, bunch of varieties of 762. The prices were, as you can imagine, painful. If you bought any, I'm not gonna see whether I did or not. Cause I really can't afford to buy a whole lot right now. But if you need them, cause I have a pretty good stockpile, I guess, good enough for me. Uh, they're available, they had a lot of magazines, a lot of firearms for sale. But I did some stuff in the garden. Uh, we finally got a little rain last night after I, of course, after I watered the garden, but uh, I gave up on these two beds and I have some early germinating seeds, so I put some, in this garden bed right here, I put uh, some cucumbers in that garden bed. I put some jalapenos uh, and in that garden bed down there, I pulled out all the squash that was dead and put some more jalapenos. I got some pretty cucumbers. I'm trying to keep them off the ground. Need to get in there and do a little work, pull the vines up. Uh, tomatoes, I have a few finally starting to turn red. And where the straw bales fell over, I thought I pulled all the bean plants up, but I got a few green beans, so that's good. Uh, the beans I planted later when I pulled these garden beds up are, are starting to blossom. So it's not too late. I'll get some beans. I hope. It's my favorite vegetable. Uh, some of these aren't looking real great. It's been a disappointing year in the garden this year so far. but Hopefully I've been watering enough to still save it. If I don't see some squash in this garden bed within the next week, I'm going to pull them vines up. Chickens like to eat them. Uh, I emptied a potato bucket and I got three whopping potatoes out of it. So I think right around in this area somewhere I'm going to build another one of these double decker garden beds or maybe even a triple decker and use that for potatoes. I've tried them in buckets. I've tried a potato box. And I used, when I was a kid, we had a row of potatoes 100 feet long. We get potatoes for two families for the for the all winter so frustrating in the garden this year but now's the time to learn what you're doing wrong and keep practicing keep working uh, the chickens are doing good I gave a uh, how many eggs did I give away yesterday I gave away three dozen yesterday and I gave away another dozen to one of my neighbors today so still have eggs left over and I gave another dozen at work to somebody last week so. and uh, the guy that went with me the rural king I gave him so many eggs he bought a bag of feed for me so that's fine that, that was appreciated uh, rural king is a, a great store I like it a whole lot better than I do uh, tractor supply so what else am I gonna do there's a bunch of leaves up there I'm gonna get them up and take them down, put them in the compost pile, turn the compost pile over. Other than that, I think today's going to be a low key day. I got some other preps I'm not going to mention. Well, I'll mention one of them I did add to my coffee stuff fund stash storage because I found a sale on it at China Mart. So that's good. Try to shop cheap, but just keep after it, keep being persistent. A little bit at a time adds up if you'll throw extra five or ten dollars that you can cut out of your budget 
maybe not have a Starbucks coffee on Friday and use five dollars to buy some canned vegetables or a bag of rice or beans. It'll add up quickly. Uh, project for today, this afternoon after I get those leaves up, try to drag my generator out and start it up. I'm supposed to start them over three months or so and I think I'm a couple of weeks behind on that. But other than that, that's all we're going to do today. Uh, grill some meat later on this afternoon. Uh, not going to water the garden tonight because uh, it rained pretty good last night after I went to bed. And we're supposed to have some pretty good chance of rain showers the rest of the week. And it's going to be busy here in my little neighborhood today. I think we've got a couple of birthday parties going on around the house. So little Rosie won't be allowed to get out and stretch her legs. Doesn't really do me any good to take her out on the leash because she likes to run, so maybe she can get out tomorrow after church. But that's it. I hope y'all have a good weekend. Everybody stay safe. Keep your head on a swivel. Uh, and keep on prepping. I'll talk to you guys later. Adios, amigos.